Hey there, I'm excited to share some incredible ways you can improve your focus and concentration while gaming. These methods is backed up by the scientific literature and will certainly have a positive impact on your performance when used properly. Some of the methods will be more effective than others, but it's important to know the differences and what impact they each have on the brain and body. First, I wanna talk about the use of white noise before playing a match to help you transition into a more focused state. White noise uses a mix of sound frequencies to create a static-like sound. This can be extremely beneficial if you have trouble getting into a focused state. Research studies have shown that this type of noise can help release specific chemicals in the brain, which in turn amplifies the activity in the prefrontal cortex. The prefrontal cortex is the part of the brain that is responsible for the ability to direct focus and stay focused on certain things. This is especially useful, as it allows you to immerse yourself more in the game and maintain that concentration for longer periods of time. Let's stay with sounds for the next method, because listening to binaural beats can help you focus better. Binaural beats works by playing sounds with two different frequencies in each ear. It creates a third frequency that gets integrated within deep brain centers. This can increase levels of specific neurochemicals responsible for focus and concentration. Studies have found that a 40 HZ frequency is most effective to improve focus and concentration. As with the white noise, try listening to binaural beats before playing a match or doing aim training. People might react differently, so you should experiment with different frequencies, volume levels, and how long you listen to them to find what works best for you. Now let's talk about what I believe is the most effective way you can improve focus. This method is about exposing yourself to cold water. You can do this by fully immerse yourself in cold water or simply just take a cold shower. Studies have shown that this method increases stress levels in the body, leading to improved cognitive performance. This is because cold water activate the body's fight and flight response, which triggers the release of hormones such as adrenaline and noradrenaline. These hormones is incredible to improve long-lasting focus and concentration. You might wonder, how cold should the water be? The water should be as cold as you want to get out because it's uncomfortable to stay in it. If you go to the extreme and use ice baths, please note that cold exposure can be associated with certain health risks. Now let's talk about supplements. Supplements can help improve your focus and concentration by providing the brain with the right nutrients. The most well-known supplement for increased focus is caffeine. It helps by stimulating the nervous system and increasing the release of certain neurotransmitters that are associated with cognitive function. Caffeine can be found in coffee, tea, and most energy drinks. Fish oil or omega-3 fatty acid can also be beneficial and have been closely related with brain function and cognitive performance. Omega-3 can be found naturally in foods such as salmon, avocado, eggs, spinach, walnuts, etc. Creatine is a supplement that has a strong potential to improve focus and concentration by increasing the amount of energy available to the brain. It has also been shown to benefit short-term memory and thinking skills. You can find the powerful supplement naturally in red meat. The last supplement is choline or alpha-GPC, which is naturally found in the brain. Choline is an essential nutrient that serves as a precursor for the synthesis of acetylcholine, a neurotransmitter involved in cognitive processes such as memory and attention. Remember that each individual might have different needs and sensitivities to these supplements. It's always best to consult a healthcare professional before taking any supplement, especially if you have any pre-existing health conditions or are taking any medications. Lastly, I want to mention the power of taking breaks to defocus. Defocus is important for your brain to rebuild its capacity. Studies have shown that our brain works in cycles of 90 minutes, and after 90 minutes of focusing, it's beneficial to take a break and do something that doesn't require a lot of concentration. This helps your brain stay focused for longer times, meaning you can keep performing without getting as tired. You should take at least 10 minutes and even up to 30 minutes to defocus. During this time, try not to do any cognitive demanding activities. In the end, there are many ways and methods you can use to improve your focus. By implementing these strategies, you can potentially improve your performance through higher levels of focus. Experiment with the different methods to see what works best for you. 